Oh, jam. Hello, everyone, and welcome back to Eternal Darkness, Sanity's Requiem. <laughs> oh, good. My sword stopped whispering. Now the whispering is just coming from the ambient noise. So, in the last episode... Well, in the last stream, we did everything up to this point. In the last YouTube video... We were the portly guy, Maximilian Roivas, and we found the ch ch blah, 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 the Chaturga rune, which means I can now heal myself at will. Yes, and we also found the next chapter page: a journey into darkness. We also got a cutscene. Where they have found the heart of Mantarok. The bad guys, Pius and Zelotov. And they're gonna go get it. And I think that's where this chapter comes in. So, let's go. The Ancients' influence was incredible. From all walks of life to all parts of the world, their tendrils crept and wrought their insidious damage. Their prisons decayed constantly as their guardian's work continued. I discovered mention of a breakthrough in satellite radar imaging that revealed the presence of a hitherto unknown temple mound in the Angkor Thom region of Cambodia. An archaeologist of some repute, Dr. Edwin Lindsay, took it upon himself to investigate the area, to reveal the secrets of history. Unfortunately, the local government at the time thought differently, requiring that Lindsay find other means into the country and to finance the expedition. He found these in Paul Augustine, a collector of rare items who professed an interest in the discovery and agreed to help. After a dysentery riddled two week venture, Whoops. Lindsay and Augustine located the remains of an ancient city temple dating back to the 12th century. This is in 1983. Cool. Yes, this is it. It has to be. I hadn't expected the information to pan out, but here it is. The satellite data was correct. For years, I have searched for it without success. Here, all along, clouded from us beneath the great ancient's insidious magic. I am very pleased with your performance, Dr. Lindsay. Very pleased. Why do you look and like a zombie already? So pleased that I will give you an early bonus. Yeah! Yeah, get him, Edwin Lindsay. God! You are a scholar, Dr. Lindsay. It was a Paul Not a Augustine. Warrior. In that regard, I have several centuries more experience than you. Yup, that's pious. Don't be a fool. Die quietly. And you will not suffer. You cannot escape me, Lindsay. This place will be your tomb. Just as it is Mantarox. What the hell is that? Zelotov, kill him! Okay. What is that face? Stop making that face. You missed me, bitch. Come on, open up. I'm working on the reload. Hang on. I keep trying to turn the camera like this is that kind of game. Yeah! Give me that sanity back. 
Jerk wad. What am I? Okay. A thick layer of dust obscures the tiles of the floor. Good, good, good job. Screw this, I'm going home. Lindsay has no intention of leaving the temple yet. He's determined to get to the artifact before Augustine does. No one crosses Edwin Lindsay. Fine. So, yeah, apparently what happened... Wait a minute. Statue of a seated goddess. Where her neck and wrists should bear jewelry, there are merely worn grooves and flecks of bronze dust. Had they been stolen by grave robbers? What? No. Um, so this is where you might recognize. This is where we were when we were Elia. When we got Mantarok's heart. And then Pius just up and killed Elia without bothering to check to see if she had the heart. Because Pius, it turns out, is a bit of an idiot. Oh, so tired. Oh, I'm so tired. What have I got? Oh, I have shotgun shells. Holy crap. Okay, I've got my pistol with... 40 bullets. I've got an archaeologist brush. Oh. A large, soft bristled brush designed for clearing dirt and dust from surfaces without damaging them. Hmm. I've got my pistol. Since 1907, this weapon has been a trusted sidearm to U.S. armed forces. Through two world wars, Korea and Vietnam, the Colt M1911 automatic pistol has proven itself to be a reliable firearm with good stopping power. We have a kukri. Hell yeah. The unusual L shape of the kukri gives the weapon a significant advantage in close quarters. The combination of a cutting edge on the inside curve of the blade and a heavy weight of the blade tip gives the kukri immense chopping power. Remington M870 shotgun. Slightly modified with an extended, extended tube magazine. Choke barrel, rifle sights, and bayonet lug. Damn. This is the same shotgun used by the U.S. Marine Corps since 1970. And a torch. And some ammo. Did not realize that I had my little brush. That's why it was like, hey, there's dirt. And I was like, good job. <laughs> a bronze bracelet has been discovered under the dust covering the floor. An exquisite bronze bracelet designed to be worn around the wrist or ankle. It's embellished with inset gems and engravings. Yay, embellishment. Here you go, lady. I got you this bracelet. It doesn't fit there, but sure. But anyway, yeah. Apparently what, what happened was, after... Oh, Lord. Hang on, we have to go get a book from the floor that screams at us. Hey, Kareem. Hey, Kareem. M. Royals. Yay, look at him. He's pulling. Yeah, 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 take the book. You shouldn't take the book, but you're gonna take the book. Yeah, may the rats eat your eyes. But yeah, after Pius killed Elia and then left, Mantarok was like, I'm gonna make it so you can never find this place again. And that's exactly what he did. Which is why Pius couldn't just go back. He had to get a human to find the joint. Okay. Hey, this looks familiar. Yep. And that's where we come in. Oh, crap. Damn. 
see here. Ooh. A metal bracelet? Yeah, let's take it. Trapdoor? No trapdoor. A seemingly worthless bracelet made from cheap flawed metal. The workmanship is rather crude. It is probably junk. Dog on Stepiani dudes. Hey, big fella! Why are you so angry? Are you not coming at me? Bronze necklace sits on top of a nearby urn. Well, give it to me. Ow! Dick! That was quick spell. Uh, what if? Hang on. No, that is what I wanted. What if I enchant with Chaturga and my shotgun? <laughs> Time reloading the shotgun, that's nice. What do you the corner is shrouded with dense cobwebs casting it in the shadow, perhaps even hiding something? Okay. Just <laughs> there we go. Summon. Okay, I'll take summon. What are you looking at? Guess I'll find out later when I really don't want to know. Why is the angle different? I keep looking up at something. That concerns me. All right, we're gonna use this even though this is probably just not gonna work. Can I use that now, see? So that'll open that door over there, yep. I remember things. Oh, that opened that door too. Cool. Well, we're going to gonna go this way first particular depiction represents the birth of the human race within the universe this is humanity's dawn okay oh stone statue of a naga a snake-headed demon stands guard in the corner of the room a raised platform stands before it with a bracelet on it should Lindsay pick up the bracelet? Uh, maybe in a minute. Yeah, all right, let's get the bracelet. What's the worst that could happen, right? Sorry. Here, have this cheap piece of crap. Jesus. I don't know why everyone's all anti-grave robber here. I like 
the way Lindsay has not commented once on any of the zombies or any of that. He's just like, nope, I'm a badass. I am Indiana Joe. I am Idaho Smith. Oh my god. No, 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 no. Piss off. You also piss off. You piss off. No, oh, just get off me. Yeah, you guys kick each other's asses. Thank you. Nope, 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 nope. Ah, you missed. Don't examine. It's still vacant. Thank you. Finish him. All right. We're good. Yes. Thank you. I'm trying to... There we go. Oh, yeah. I found a magic gold rune. All right. Uh, runes. Oh, no. Huh, okay. Not there yet. Oh, God. I hate to see a dumb zombie animal suffer. Hey girl, hey! Hiding in the shadows, a statue watches over the room. A brief inspection reveals flecks of silver metal marring the statue's wrist and neck. Possibly indicating that a decoration used to be there. Yeah, yeah. Hang on, what's over here? Aha! A place to use my little brush! Sweep, sweep, sweep! A spell. Oh, yeah, give me that taint scroll. Dispel magic. That's what I need in the house for the, uh, uh, you know, stained glass. Okay, spell list. What did we just learn to spell magic? Yeah, hell yeah. I don't want spells, though. I want silver bracelet. Let's look at this. Exquisite bracelet made from silver. Designed to be worn around the wrist or angle inside gems and engravings. Yeah, okay. Oh. Here you go, sweetheart. Look, that one fits. Now what did that do? Nothing that I saw. Oh! Hey, big fella. Guess what I learned? Spell list. Dispel. Oh, I can't cast it. Huh. It reads, For every magic there is a counter. That which is protected is protected no more. That which is bound is unbound. Be warned that a more powerful magic than this will endure its ravages. Huh. You suspect. Uh, let's go back this way, actually. Okay, nothing to see here. Oh, right there. Use my little brush. Aha! Yes, I have. Yeah! No area. Okay. Right. Now we can go back and murder the big dude. Ass. Ass. Screw this. We're just running. Just running. Just running. Just running. Okay. So first, I want to enchant my shotgun. And, uh, this guy. I'm not fooling with this guy. 
enchanted my shotgun. Then we're going to dispel into turbo. <laughs> Yeah! How you like that, asshole? Oh! Hey, that was cool. Like I said, we're not screwing around, we're just gonna kill that immediately. Dead. Take that, you big ugly horror. Ooh, a silver necklace. Don't mind if I do. So that goes on. Mm, made it. Run in, run in, run, run in, run in, run. Did I run past her? Was she here? What are you looking at? Oh, God, that freaks me out. Like something's gonna drop down on my head. I did run past it. Well crafted, there's plenty. Yeah, okay. Oh. Okay. We go in here. Black under my faith, of, the faith in humanity in here. You have to actually equip the torch. You can't just look at it. Can I light this? No. Okay. Oh, that's not a good sign. Set your ass on fire, didn't I? Thank you. Somebody saw me. Whoa! Okay, okay, okay. Summon a zombie? Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. Stop it! Damn it. Alright, you know what? I can do that. I can do that too. Sorta. Of. Uh, spell list. We are going to... Oh yeah, let's damage field. And red. you summon things just to punch them yourself, you big idiot?
Okay, now we need to run up here a little bit more. I am completely out. Recover sanity. There we go. So clearly, this damn thing needs to be attacked from a distance. Crap, not that one. Then we need to reload. Oh, you got back up! Holy crap! Oh my god, that scared the crap out of me. Okay. Well, that was fun. Wasn't that fun? That was fun. I haven't saved yet. I still haven't. There we go. Oh, missed. What was that? See what I mean? Thank you. those lines I think that's an emulation thing not a uh, sanity thing oh you know what I never looked for my copy of turn your belly aching. Hey, buddy. Statue of carved granite depicting a ceremonial temple guard. It appears to be keeping watch on the seated goddess in the corner of the room. Statue of an unknown goddess seated in a classical pose. She appears to be carrying something valuable. no option to take it. Panel recessed slightly into the wall. It looks like it can be pressed. Should Lindsay press the pen? No. Let's let's look around first. If I step off, it's going to turn back, isn't it? Yep, okay. Alright, let's try to find something heavy. Or we could just leave. Nope. Maybe I have to be quick. that yeah push a button what the hell was that Did that 
do something down here. Well, I didn't seem to get. Appears to be a hole in the wall. It's large enough for a small dog to pass through. Okay, this is teaching me to use the summon spell. Which I don't have yet. What does this tell me to use? Zelototh, that, and that. Okay, do I have both of those? Oh, I don't have this last one. Well, guess we're getting some sanity back. Okay. Yeah, I don't have that last rune. So, let's go find it. Oh, crap. Found it! Ow, dick! Die. Okay, so we need to dispel blue, which is green. Right? Red beats green, which means green beats blue, and blue beats red. Got it. So, spell list, dispel magic, Julio. Oh, wait, no, that's a weird pit. Do it again. What is this? Hello! Small basin or font situated beneath the statue. Beside that, an orb shaped button sits on a panel of stone. Should Lindsay push the button? Sure, why not? Okay. This water smells like a strong acid, perhaps strong enough to dissolve metal or flesh if Lindsay isn't careful. Alright. So clearly, I have to put something in it. go this way. Somebody saw me. Ah! Free sanity! Oh god. Ah! Idiot. Oh, 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 okay, run. No, no, we're leaving, we're leaving. Goodbye, goodbye. What's up, Turga zombie? No, you didn't. I hate Chaturga zombies, because they take, they take so much of beating. And then their bits grow back. Stop growing your head back. Stop hitting me. Come here. Jesus. What? Edwin, kill it. Good job, buddy. Heal up. That's a lot of healing. Thank you. Okay, so now we need to dispel red. Yeah, suck on that, nerd. Here's another button to press. Hello. Aren't you cute? Oh. Hey, buddy. 
Do I have to press all these and run between them or something? this here oh no gotta go fast Opens that up. Yeah. Give me my shoddy. down now. Thank you. Oh ho! This must be the summon room. Nope, it's just another necklace. Oh, but I have to clean it off. Yep, okay, I remember now. Push a goddamn button. That's the button. Ah, here we go. So we want to put this in here. Yep. And then we want to push a button. And then we'll fill up and clean off our necklace. Ta da! God, it's hard. It's hard being this good all the time. Okay, you don't get treasure. Sorry. Whoa! My bad. There's a side door. This is this this is where I came in. This isn't a side door. Okay, zombie. Always making things harder on me. Didn't make it. Didn't make it. Made it. Come on. All right, Sanic. Come on, you gotta go fast. Ooh. Almost died. I'm so lost. gonna save. Why can't I save? Oh. Aha! Can I save now? No. Here, have this. Here, have this. Praise be. 
Okay, now I'm gonna run over here real quick just to make sure I haven't missed something. Oh, it's a big loot. Oh, okay. I still don't know what those panels do. Oh god. Oh god. Oh, oh, oh god. Cutscene! Remember me, Alex. How can I forget you, Grandpa? You've always meant the most to me. Ever since... Wait. Ever since my parents died. Yes. Ever since they were killed. You've been my little girl. Yes. My little girl. This can't be happening. And apparently he saw that. down again. These assholes don't catch fire. Yeah, yeah, y'all knock the shit out of each other. Terga horror. That is just what I didn't want today. Okay, hang on. Okay, so now I want to make what beats blue, red beats green, so blue beats red. Enchant shotgun. I'll go to hell. I got an enchanted shotgun. I will shit directly into your breakfast cereal. Ah. Oh, don't go in the room and immediately look up. It worries me. I thought that was a door. Oh, it's not. It's not even remotely a door. It's just dark in here. I swear one of these days something's gonna drop down from the ceiling. Yeah. Crap! Made it. Oh look! More zombie. Oh wait, these guys catch fire. <laughs> How do you like me now? Oh, teeth when I smile. That's good enough. Let's use a little brush. Sweep, 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 sweep. Finally. I can now summon creature, I think. Oh, wait. Do I know summon yet? Oh no, I don't have summon yet. Crap. But once I find the rune, I can summon creature. The rotted mural appears to depict the arrival of a strange godlike entity before an ancient human tribe. Lindsay cannot recognize the god in the mural. He is mystified. Ah, oh, okay, there's Mantarak, I think. Arriving for the first time. Old fangs and eyes. You know I love him. Be 
people never heard of electricity. Oh, right. Do, do, do. Don't step on the crack or you'll uh, get killed and won't come back. Last time, I think those are the ones that explode. Oopsies. No burning. when Lindsay like a boss you're a scholar not a warrior he says as I utterly destroy everything in front of me yeah who's not a warrior Paul Augustine more like nerd. Ah. I like doing this. Okay, what's going on over here? A dilapidated mural depicts the ancient Khmer people coexisting with some kind of fertility god. The aquifer sacrifice to the beast in return are showered with benevolence, good crops, and hunting. Well, there's a naked chick dancing. That's always good. I guess it's a fertility god, so... Yeah. Okay. Digging the polygonal fire there, that's always good. Can't see shit, Captain. That's the one I came in, isn't it? Hang on. You're going the wrong way. Whoops. Crap. Crap. guys catch fire. There's a room. Oh, yeah. Turn around! What? Get off of me, asshole. Give me some of that sweet, sweet sanity back. Never mind. Dick! Fine. Damage engraving on the wall depicts a skeletal demon befriending the ancient Khmer people. To Lindsay's eyes, the demon looks exactly like Paul Augustine's undisguised self. Uh, yeah. There's a reason for that, bruh. Now do I have summon? I do. Okay, so hang on. New spell. We're going to summon. Yeah. 
I can protect creature. Okay. Okay, just, just playing around with some magic. Ow! Didn't realize you were going to start going. Yeah. Oh look, yeah, summon trapper. Yeah, you don't say. I figured that one out already. All right, there are way too many of you assholes. you come from? No exploding. Thank you. Insanity. Thank you. Oh, the screen isn't... The screen is shaking. I thought it was just because of where I was walking. A little bit more sanity, thank you. Come on. Thank you. No exploding. I said no exploding. That's different than exploding, jerk. Are we all quite dead now? What is this? It finds this mural frighteningly familiar. It is the scene he saw in the Tome of Eternal Darkness. The fertility god must be Mantarok, and this temple must be its tomb. Oh, is this where he got bound? Yeah, this is where he got bound. Poor Mantarok. Walk through the door. Oh, yeah, this is where we're going to see him, aren't we? Step on the manta rock. I didn't do that. <laughs> That's this button. I, my finger was nowhere near that button. What was that about? Cutscene! not easily controlled. What makes you think I want to control it? Yeah, <laughs> dick. Arrogant man. Kill him! Make what are you sure talking you Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Thanks, Mansarok. Mansarok got my back. Not really, but... The darkness shall... Prevail. Great Southern Pansy. Thanks, buddy. The Corpse God, Mantarok, defies all human description. Massive, amorphous, perhaps. But these words only capture the gross nature of the beast, not the specifics. Its form, seemingly without design or true function, stirs as Lindsay nears, awakened by his presence. With every breath, the creature's many mouths sigh and cough, sputtering in its torturous death throes. I never... I can't. Dude, dude, you're fine. Look, your health is over halfway full. Chill. I don't care how broken your brain is. 
Cutscene. Hey, Elia. Do not touch the heart, flesh and bone, lest you become like me, a dead, rotted husk. I have waited many centuries for you. It was not easy hiding from the Dark Ones as they searched for me. At first they passed by, not thinking that the heart was inside my dead body. But I was forced to find refuge here. You must seal the heart so it never contacts your flesh, and take it to the Gathering of Light. Take the heart there, Boy, or the mentioned. world shall fall under a reign of eternal darkness. Oh, oh, he said the name. Roll credits again. The veil of reality can only be pulled back so far, mortal. Take your stand and fight the darkness. Wait, is this Grandpa? <gasps> it is! The demon and the Khmer. Hmm. But wait, there's stuff I didn't do! What did I miss? That's why I saved before I went in the door. Cutscene! Nope, not a cutscene. We're going back. I never used the trapper to go through the little room, and I don't know what's in there. And it's clearly not, like, necessary to finish the chapter. Which means we've got a long walk back. Cause I want to know what's in there, damn it. It's my luck. It's like the Manta Rock rune that I missed or something. Ooh, made it. Okay. And my head fell off. Damn it! Pick up, pick, pick up the head. Pick, pick up. My head's gone. Did I kick it? Where'd my head go? Oh, my arm fell off. Now I have, I'm just a torso and legs. This can't be happening. You are correct, it can. Don't you hate it when you walk into a room and your head falls off and then your arms and legs fall off? It happened to me last Thursday. I'm going back to get something secret. I just realized that was a face. That's cool. Why am I huge? This can't be happening. Oh my god, sanity effects. What the hell? I thought the game glitched out. There's no one there. Shut up. And I'm shrinking. This isn't really happening. Edwin, you seem to have a lot of sized based fears. I'm just saying. Oh, it's right here. It's right here. It's right here. Okay, so we're going to stand right here, and we're going to summon a trapper, yeah, summon a, I don't know, a turkey trapper, come on. Oh, look at him, he's cute! After trapper's been surrendered, press A to trap an enemy when it is targeted using R. Press...
I don't know what the hell I'm supposed what that button is. It's a GameCube control. Probably start? It's probably start. Trappers cannot open doors nor pick up items. Okay, cool. What the hell? Oh my god, I was right. It is... It is the Manta Rock Room. Oh, shit. <gasps> hey, Jay Spencer. Okay. What color are you? You're green. Okay, so that means I need a shotgun. Yeah. What? Oh, come on, sanity! Clack, cooked cookery, kill it and get a big chunk of sanity back, thank you. Uh, let's get some health back again because it punched me pretty good. Thank you. For God's sake. Oh! Ha! Ah, a trapper trapping something kills the trapper. I forgot. Use my little brush. Soop, 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 soop. And there is my Manta Rock tablet. Okay, this was totally worth it. I'm gonna kill you for pissing me off. I hope you understand. This is for my own good. Yep. Oh, I can't. Oh, yeah, I can. Ceiling's bleeding again. Hey, pharmacist judge. Ah, I completely forgot this is where you get the Manta Rock rune. So the Manta Rock rune is um, all three runes. So like if I do recover with Manta Rock, all three of them go the blue and not so much but everything goes up and that's awesome <laughs> and the ceiling's bleeding again okay welcome back youtube viewers for you just a moment has passed <laughs> all right so now think in metroidvania terms a friend of mine who was watching the stream uh, later commented that the mansion is a big metroidvania and I went because it is so now we have wait what the hell was that is my sanity low enough for flying books oh yeah it is okay So 
So where is the heart of Mantarok? Should be right here. Alex discovers a pulp novel written by one Dr. Edwin Lindsay amongst the books on the shelf. This is where the Tome of Internal Darkness indicated that something of value was hidden behind this book. Should Alex look behind the book? Sure, why not? Oh dear. The book removed a secret cache is revealed inside is the Heart of Mantarok. Encased in glass to protect the world from its corrosive energies. Should Alex claim the Heart of Mantarok? I mean... No? Metrox's heart pulses with unholy life. Although the corpse god itself festers elsewhere, its power resides within this artifact. Yeah. All right, books. This is a library. You will stop that. You hear me, books? Hey. That's not funny. No. Bad books. Damn it. 